Hey everybody, it's uh, John Hale here again, and uh, today I have something very special to show off. This is the limited edition He-Man and She-Ra uh, complete guide to the classic animation adventures. So it's um, an episode guide for both shows. And uh, first off, I say special thanks to the folks at uh, He-Man.org for sending me an advanced copy of this. Um, like I said, this is the limited edition. Um, and by limited, I mean there's only going to be a thousand copies of this one made. And as you can see, what makes it special is first off, it has this <clears throat> hollow foil dust jacket. And on the cover it has He-Man and She-Ra in their transformation a moment and from the show and it's pretty cool as you can see it changes with the light and here's the side view you can see it better this way it says He-Man and She-Ra the complete guide to the classic animation adventures there are both power swords right there by Dark Horse and on the back you have the two main villains Skeletor and Hordak it looks like there's possibly Snake Mountain in the background. It does have that hollow, um, hollow foil on the back as well. Very nicely done. And then, if you open it up, it also has this faux leather uh, cover, which has the power swords and this foil stamping on it. And it does it looks fabulous. Um, and all together on the shelf, it looks great. And a part also of the limited edition is all the pages come with this gold um, gilded edges here. And if you're interested in picking this up, uh, before we get into the contents of the book, you can find it at hemart.myshopify.com, uh, which is he-mart dot myshopify.com. Um, I'll leave a link down below in the uh, description area. And so far, when I've looked at this book, it's amazing. So let's take a quick look inside, and I'll show you what this um, book entails. So here is um, the How to Use the Guide. And it shows you what you can find information on, everything from episode titles, production numbers, script approvals and revisions, the air dates, the cast, trivia... Uh, deleted scenes, um, the scenes where they um, recycle the animation, yeah, everything from um, mo the morals of the episode. So if you just take a look at a page here, which is, uh, as you can see, it's The Friend in Need, uh, written by uh, Stevens, directed by Friedman, script approved on 1983, final script on August, it gives all this information, the cast of characters that are in the episode, even gives you some memorable uh, quotes, like, uh, it made me feel good at first, but it wore off and I needed more and more, um, when Alina's is talking about her addiction, uh, it gives you the moral of the story, which is in today's story, um, Alina tried taking a magic potion, which she thought would make that would help her. Well, she found out there there ain't any magic potions, and you know what? There ain't any magic drugs either. Anytime you take one from anybody, but your parents or your doctor, you're taking a very big chance. You're gambling with your health, maybe even with your life. Drugs don't make your problems go away; they just create more. And it shows you some of the uh, drawings used in the show, some of the uh, pre artwork. A uh, little bonus, the power of He-Man. He-Man proves that his muscle is stronger than science in this episode when he battles the transmutator and manages to stop the entire royal pa uh, palace from shrinking. And the transmutator in response explodes. And it shows, uh, talks about deleted scenes. Uh, and it gives a bunch of trivia on the side. And then... It also shows you some of the design work and... Um, sketches that went into the episode, which I really like this kind of stuff. I love when there's uh, artwork in this book. And like I said, this covers every episode. So it's 600 pages of 
fantastic artwork and imagery. Evil Wind's plot. Reign of the Monster. The Royal Cousin. I remember that one. He was such a snotty little brat. Oh, look, there's the one on Evil Seed. The power of He-Man. He-Man throws a large chunk of ice from the ice mountain across Eternia to Castle Grayskull. Um, like I, I just love this artwork that's in here. Tale of Two Cities. Eye of the Beholder. The rarest gift of all. Great artwork right there. And then as you keep going, it will switch over from He-Man to She-Ra. And you continue on with an episode guides for all of hers. Character designs. Synapses of every show. So if you're a fan of the animated series He-Man or She-Ra, this is definitely a must-have. Like I said, it's a limited edition for this version. And there's only going to be a thousand of them. So you definitely want to pre-order it if you want to get your hands on it. And I'm really blown away by it right now. There's so much time and effort that they put into this. Um, yeah, it's a fantastic book. Just every random page you open up to has something fascinating in it. Wish we could take the time and read through every storyline, and um, I might have to go through and watch the episodes all again. Um, I love the memorable quotes. The trivia is great. Like the lighting effect that surrounds He-Man and covers the sword was actually used in a memorable promotion image from the show, minus the glow. The objects from Orko's hat are as follows: the magic, or the book of magic, the globe, the, a boot, a hat, and finally a goblet. So it gives you all sorts of stuff about every single episode. the storyboard from rough rough pencils to final paints that's a really nice touch well there you have it that is the He-Man and She-Ra the complete guide to the classics animated adventures the limited edition version fantastic book thank you so much for uh, sending this along and uh, I'm really glad I got to take a look at it. So guys, if you're interested, take a look at the description down below and be sure to pre-order it. Um, or you're going to miss out on it. This is a very nice item to add to your collection if you're a fan. Um, even if you're just a fan of the show and not the toys. It's uh, great. And if you enjoyed this at all or learned something new, go ahead and hit that... Uh, like button down there and maybe subscribe for some more videos and um thanks for watching and i'll see you around okay so i had to add one little thing onto this i just noticed that there is a little flip book style running he-man in the corner that's pretty cool um yeah this book is a lot of hard work and very cool so I suggest you try to get one. Anyway, thanks again. Bye.